Well, each, you know, step, each level is definitely an adjustment. So in itself, it's something that you need to learn from. And I think the college level is definitely different from the pro level. So there's obviously that transition that must take place that is going on right now. What's your most NBA ready skill, would you say? I'm just a basketball player, you know what I mean? I can compete, I can make shots, I can put the ball in the basket, I can defend, I'm long and athletic. Like everything that God has blessed me with that I've worked hard for is, you know, to be a really good basketball player. And most of the time, really good basketball players end up going professional. How familiar were you with uh, Toronto before the workout? Had you been here before? I've never been here, actually, but I got a couple of teammates, you know, that hype up the city. And Nick's say, told you good yeah, things? Yeah, real good things, you know, and we're always going at it. What's better, you know, Toronto or New York City and <laughs> things like that. But it's a great city, you know. I had a guy come up to me and give me a hug and congratulate me <laughs> during the season and yeah. stuff for the season and stuff like that. So it's, it's real nice out here. I like it. How often do people bring up the Kentucky game with you? Often. Yeah. Well, often. <laughs> yeah. What do, you, what do you think that kind of that game, that performance kind of did for your profile? It definitely helped. It showed that I was competitive and that I'm really, really hungry and that I want it just as bad as those guys, you know? Since the tournament, what have you been working on on your game? Pretty much everything. I know ball handling, thinking like a three coming off the screen, spot up shots off dribble shots, you know, finding my teammates in corners, pocket passes, just reading the defender, defense, anything that there is to work on in the game of basketball, I wouldn't limit myself and not do, you know, it's 24 hours in a day and there's not much else to do but play basketball and work on your craft and work on your mental and things like that and relax and, you know, just take it day by day, workout by workout. With nine workouts already, how many do you plan on doing before this process is over? Uh, maybe about you know twelve, the You're most. To the end. Yeah, I'm I'm coming to the end. I already have I have like three more scheduled for sure, but you know with good feedback you might have to go back in. You never know. I don't know, you know. But there, there's a chance I might do more. There's a chance I might stop at twelve. Have you been in contact with uh, Nick Wiggins at all? Oh yeah, that's my boy. I'm talking to him twenty four seven. You guys been kind of. About well, we don't really give each other feedback, you know, we're friends, yeah. you know, so we're just letting each other know how it is and seeing how each other's doing and, you know, that constant support and love, you know what I mean? Those are my boys. Like, you guys talk about the actual workouts? Yeah, we talk about the workouts, we talk about life, we talk about everything, you know what I mean? That's my boy. What does it feel like to know, like, I mean, like you said, you're almost at the end of the 12 workouts, like to know that you're actually not that far away from the draft and hearing your name called and... All it's, of that. A, it's a great feeling. It, it's it's real, but you have to continue to stay humble and continue to put your head down and, and, and just strive, you know, for greatness and, and just do what you've been doing. Don't get caught up in the moment, you know, don't switch up too much, you know, just just become better. Let everything change you for the better. Have you pictured that moment in your head? Like, have you? <laughs> Since I was a little kid. Yeah. Since I was a little kid. What is one thing you want people to know about you, like, whether it's fans or whether it's talking to executives and stuff like off the court that, that people might not already know. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm here to stay, you know, and I'm going to continue to improve and get better. That's it, really, you know, it's, it's not much to be said. I like to talk, but I'm, I'm obviously a person that likes to back up what he believes and, 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 and what he practices. So at the end of the day, I'm going to go out there and show and prove that, you know, I belong.